Hello and welcome back fellow PowerShell engineers. We are now going to turn off RDP using PowerShell and we're going to do that by setting a registry key and that's pretty easy to do with the set item property commandlet. So let's go ahead and do it. Set item property and of course these things always uh, auto complete because I do test them before I do it but item property we've got the path of the key there to the terminal server key and then we've got the keys name itself the F deny TS connection terminal services or terminal server or services connection and then the value is set to one right so that's what actually uh, is denying the connections by setting it to one so we do that and we start the service Well, no, no, we just turn around and stop the service. And it is that simple to do. So the other thing you would want to do is disable the startup of the service. So we could do that with the set service command. And the startup type would be disabled. So it can never be started again. So is that simple to turn off? Just set the property, stop the service, and then turn the startup type to disabled. So I hope you guys found that helpful. I uh, recently heard the term for RDP, uh, ransomware deployment protocol. And again, that's why we would be doing this because it is how a threat actor could potentially be moving laterally around in your network. So. Thank you so much, PowerShell engineers. I will see you again soon.